<sighs> Damn, Q. Maybe you did that. Yo, 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 you know what it is, man. Everybody loves BBW. That's beards, bourbon, whiskey, the podcast. Whole gang is in the building, man. I got my man Angry Principal in the building. What's up? Got my man Bo holding it down. And of course, man, it's your boy Q Lewis holding it down live from the 48205, man. Red zone, baby. Yo, we are still at the Black Spirits event uh, tonight, downtown Detroit. Um, special guest in the building. <laughs> Very special guest. Now, we, we've had, uh, we've reviewed thoughts. Uh, on uh, an episode not too long ago. Were we give it like four black power fish? Yeah, we did. We gave that shit. It was, it was high. But then at the end of the show, we decided we was going to try the, the Manhattan uh, the Manhattan mix, right? Of the thoughts. Well, I, 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 I completely I, hated it. Right. I <laughs> called it trash, all kind of shit. <laughs> kind of tastes like uh, cough medicine at the back end a little bit. I, Again, I may just be biased because the mix is just, I, I don't like it at all. I think it completely kills. Have you ever had kills. it just a straight up Manhattan? I haven't. Okay, so. so that's, it's, this it's, is definitely that's a what Manhattan, it is. Manhattan mix, okay. sure. It's definitely okay. a Manhattan taste. Okay. The mixture with the Manhattan, I'm completely against it. Again, if you are familiar and you like Manhattan mixes, then that could work. I wouldn't suggest the uh, the actual mix. And lo and behold, we at the event tonight, and guess who's here, dog? Introduce yourself, bro. Yeah, my name is Hardy from Brooklyn, New York, uh, maker of Thoughts Bourbon and the Manhattan Concrete <laughs> Thoughts. And uh, yeah, when I saw you guys, I saw the review and I don't, like I said, I don't, if everybody has their opinion and then but when I saw your take on it, I was like, okay, that's scary. That's, that's great. <laughs> but then I was like, okay, you never really experienced a Manhattan. And then, you know what? To the point where I don't know if I'm going on script. Oh, no, you good, bro? No, you good. People that are having the Manhattan here. So, so for me, outside, like I don't know what the Manhattan experience is outside mm -hmm. of New York. Got gotcha. you. Know what I'm yeah, saying? Gotcha. So it's, it's weird when I hear people have you tasted the Manhattan outside of New York. So I'm just like, do these? Guys, do you really know how it's supposed to taste? Right. I'm a Manhattan snob. So I'm just like, you gotta have it right the way the way it's the way it's intended. So, it's intended. So I think we did say if you like Manhattan, you'll like this drink. No, definitely. But at the time, we didn't because that just wasn't that wasn't our thing. Right. Right. So so the thing about Manhattan is if if you if you don't like a Manhattan, it's probably the bitters. Like people mm -hmm. either right. like bitters or you don't. It's right. like hey, you can't kind of like or right. kind of right. you either yeah. like it or you mm -hmm. don't because it's so it dominates the drink for sure. It and I, I think that's what it was. It's like an old fashioned. If you don't mess, you don't, don't get the, the mix right. You know, it's like right. it's 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 off. Yeah, yeah, right here for sure. So and, and the thing was like so when we got when we got here. And he pulled me over to this to the side. And I was flagging you down. Like, yeah. yeah. And so I, I get to I get to looking behind me like shit, you talking to me. So then we get over there and like we explain the situation, what's going on. But what you did for me though, is you added like some cherries you gotta to it. Right? Cherry. Now see, obviously that's something that we didn't have. Dark cherry though. Dark cherry. Dark, dark cherry. Dark cherry. That maraschino cherry. Yeah. 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 Oh, so it's gotta be, right. It's gotta <laughs> be and, so and, you know, something I forgot. So you was like it was I think you was like it was kind of weak. So it, it's a one to one Manhattan. Mm -hmm. So would you so it's a it's a fifty fifty. They call it a fifty fifty Manhattan. Gotcha. So typically it's two to one. So it's two parts bourbon, whiskey, or rye to one part sweet vermouth. Gotcha. This one is uh fifty fifty. So it's okay. one part uh bourbon, one part sweet vermouth. So if you want to kick it up, yeah, add that thoughts to it. Yeah, we said that. That's exactly what he so said. That's exactly what he said. One yeah. ounce to that with the cherry, boom. On point. Yeah, for but, sure. Typically, you would make a Manhattan with a hundred proof. Listen, you would get twisted off some Manhattan thinking, yeah. it's, thinking it's light. Yeah, for sure. Ain't nothing now, but I remember alcohol. Both no juice. that you you was hip to Manhattan, so you know, yeah, you was hip to it. Nice cigar drink or after dinner drink. You know, yeah, for sure. But you're right. It's you get about two or three of them more. Right? <laughs> thinking it's really light. Drink, yeah. Like, oh, oh, Put you together. Uh, no, for but sure. it's all alcohol. Yeah. There's no yeah. juice. It's all the way together. That is true, though, right? <laughs> You're talking about it's all alcohol. It's, it's not like it's a alcohol. chaser. There's no it's juice. It's all alcohol. Yeah, it's definitely like, uh, what's that other shit I'll be drinking? Uh, 
all the Long Island and shit. Like, it's all, Long Island all liquor. Tea? Yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah, it's all, it's just all oh. liquor and shit. Yeah, so, I yeah, same kind of thing. Terrible stories on Long Island. <laughs> <laughs> I think we all. Yeah. Right. <laughs> so, tell us, uh, tell us a little bit how you got into the whole spirits uh, industry. So, I'm, I'm actually a designer. Mm-hmm. So, you see the whole setup out there. Yeah. Like, so I've designed for Godiva, chocolates, uh, okay. Canon cameras, uh, Oracle, mm. Fortune 500 companies. Yeah. So I okay. used to do the photo shoots for Godiva for their website. Okay. Word. So okay. I'm setting up all a product shots, you know, yeah. it lit. And you got to, and, and in my mind, I'm thinking like, yo, these billion dollar companies are trusting me with their look and feel to right. set up to sell their products. Yeah. So one night I'm sitting at my computer. That back in the days when I was younger, I could stay up late. <laughs> you know, right. I'm at my computer sipping something. I'm just like, yo, suppose I have my own drink. Yeah. Like, what would I call it? It's like, oh, you know what? I would call it thoughts. Cause, you know, that's how I make my money. Right. That sat for like 30 years. I ain't do nothing <laughs> with it. <laughs> I ain't do nothing with it till I met a gentleman. We had a tequila. And you know, he told me how he got into the business. Mm-hmm. And I was like, okay. I had the financing at the time. So I was like, you know what? Let's, let's try it. I'm going to yeah. try So how it became a bourbon mm-hmm. was, so I love pizza. So I'm a, so as a New Yorker, because you, because I'm, you're from I'm New York. also a pizza yeah. snob. <laughs> right. So there's a, there's a place in, uh, shout out to Weeded, Brooklyn. They, they're like, they are on point with their, with their pizza. Man. Yeah. It's, it's crazy. And, it is 360 degree bourbon whiskey. Like they got so they Damn. that was the first time I had Elijah Craig. They okay. they was they was having the small batch Elijah Craig yeah. before it was like a hundred and something yeah. dollars. Right. You know what I'm saying? And I was like, yo, I ain't know whiskey and bourbons was like this lit. Yeah, for sure. And they had so many <laughs> maybe the week or what? No, we didn't. We didn't. Yeah, we were brand new. God was a cognac drinker shit. So I think I think right. you can't be I, brown and not. And be now. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, right. So right. they they actually made a Manhattan. And that's when I when I tasted that Manhattan, I was like, Yo, what y'all put in this? Yeah. Like, for what's, sure. <laughs> what's your, yeah. What's your yeah. ingredients? So I was leading in with the Manhattan, but the guys, the the, the, te- 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 tequila guy, uh, sat down with. He told me, "Yo, you need a base." Yeah. So I was like, "Okay, so maybe I should make come out with a bourbon, opposed to a whiskey." Right. A whiskey, right. you can dip your foot in it, you still call mm-hmm. a whiskey, but yeah. a bourbon is held to a high standard. standard. It is. So for sure. I, what I always say: so whiskey, you drink like this; bourbon, you drink like this. <laughs> Shit, I drink it all like this. <laughs> I gotta keep my piggy ring clean. Shit. No, so I'm I'm Haitian, so will we have a saying? So ti doit en let that means little pinky in the air. <laughs> but sure. yeah, but but that's how I got, got how I got started. My passion for uh, brown spirits, because you know, as brown people, so. Mm-hmm. But the tagline is always in the moment, so it speaks to that present moment of work. So bourbon. Mm-hmm. You sitting back, you enjoying. So, man, go shot it. I, I gotta get you. We should be all be drinking right now. <laughs> That's my fault. That's my fault. So hey, we look, should be. I said, I said your shit was trash. You penalized us now. No, it's all good. No, 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 no. no. Because I don't even shy away from that. Because as soon as you said that, I was uh, like, I gotta reset with this guy. No, like, for sure. I, like, I appreciate that though. Because otherwise, I'd have, I'd have never went back to that man. I, I ain't gonna run, lie. Like, to you. I don't run from that because yeah. it's just like if if it, everybody's palate is different. You for know sure. What I'm saying and and I think as far as like being a, a black owned spirit, mm-hmm. like there shouldn't be any competition. Right. You know what I'm saying there's plenty of other brands that sitting up on the shelf with each other. Right. We need to be sitting on the shelf. Is this gonna because everybody has a, a, a different palate? Like you may like something. Mm-hmm. Else. Like you guys are whiskey bourbon connoisseurs. You probably like two three. Brands, out oh yeah, for sure, yeah, you know for sure. Saying? But if for different reasons, I was just for gonna different say. reasons, right. Right. and yeah. somebody you know, they'd be like, "Nah, I don't. I, I, I'm gonna rock with this one." Right. Mm-hmm. Everybody has their preference. It's right. like pizza. It's like burger. It's like burgers. Everybody right. got their own recipe, nah, and, for sure. and it's better than yours. <laughs> <laughs> right. No, that's for sure. Yeah. And so, uh, I, I ain't gonna hold you too long because I know you gotta get back. What's uh, what's next for the brand? 
trying to get in, in, in Michigan, man. Man, Michigan is a tough cookie to crack. It is. Yeah. 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 Trying to get in Michigan. Yeah. It's a control state, yeah. so. Yeah. yeah. Wow. So, no, for sure. So hopefully. Hey, Big Gretch, if you're listening, like, you said about these liquor laws. Right. No. Big Gretch. No, for sure. Damn liquor laws. What's up? <laughs> So hopefully tonight I made the right connections. So this is my second year. So okay. Last year. Yeah. And so hopefully definitely, I made... definitely the right network for sure. Yeah. I'm gonna yeah. try to. I'm. I'm not try. I'm gonna be here. I'm. A, I'm here in a few months. No doubt. We're gonna, we're gonna be here. I would come back out here. Promote. Pull up with the furniture, the paper furniture. <laughs> create that speakeasy right. now. No, that's dope though. Yo, uh, the setup is dope over there for you, sure. Nah, you, no doubt. I'm a big fan of thoughts, man. Like, no doubt. Yeah. And you know. Kind of, I'm, I'm a bit of a proof hunter, right? I'm mm. on one ten and above. And one ten <laughs> above, like, <laughs> no. don't know how, but I see most furniture drinkers right. don't, don't, don't don't track like that, right? Mm. And, uh, Ninety proof, you know, it, it's, it's strong enough, you know, for for most people out there. Well, I was really impressed with it, man. Thank nah, you. for sure. Yeah, well, thank plus you. the this taste is complex oh, enough. Man. The, yeah, yeah, the complexity of the taste for sure. Yeah, no doubt. Impressed with it, no doubt. Thank, thank you, doubt. thank you, thank you. Nah. Hey, well, look, thanks for stopping in, man. No thanks problem. for I'm thanks here, for man. proving me wrong. <laughs> you, you know what's so funny? So everything is about uh, visualization. So like I said, I had this idea for over 30 years, uh -huh. but it only took me like six months to come out with a product. Right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And I visualize us here re up having a new conversation about around the product. For before sure. I even got here, <laughs> yeah. I said, we're going to do this. No doubt. And to the point I told you, like, I, I thought we was going to be filming this, and 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 here we are. Here. Yeah, it's, nah, for sure. It's, it's right, because that's what you said over here. Like, damn, we should have been filming. Like, but well, guess what? <laughs> we set up down the hall, bro. We ran. I didn't even know that. I yeah, didn't for know sure. That, that part. No so doubt. Thank you guys, man. Yeah, thank for you. sure. So yeah, glad you uh, came back through. No, yeah. for sure. It's my pleasure. It's my and uh, continue prosperity, though. Again, like I say, I I I'm gonna be honest with you, like. I, I am a little biased with uh with black owned bourbons and whiskeys only because like they're they're so new. Mm -hmm. So a, a lot of the shit we drink is so old and like the proof yeah. is higher. Like it, there's a you know, but again, like you said, even at 90, like it don't feel like 90 though. But and the taste complexity though is 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 definitely the shit. To that comment, like I don't want to push it because it's black owned. It's got yeah. to stand up against every Facts. brown spirit Facts. on yeah. the market. I'm talking rum, cognac, anything. If it's brown, like it's gotta be good. Right. Not, Not for sure. Black owned, it's got to be quality. Yeah, for sure. But it no does doubt. stand up against some other stuff. It does. Yeah, it definitely does. It definitely does. Thank you. And, and look, and, and I'm Thank glad you. I'm glad that it does, though. Because I would hate me ha to be having this conversation. Because you will give your honest opinion. <laughs> hey, honest. Yo, fuck yeah. We go do that. We go do that. So I'm, I'm glad that yeah. we like this. Yo, when you, sure. when you, when you, ever you edit this, you got to throw in that, that part where you're like, hey, what? <laughs> yeah. I ain't going to say You know it. I am. You know I am. <laughs> right. <laughs> Cause you know when I, when I say trash, I say that shit like I fucking mean it. Yeah. <laughs> trash. I'm like, I got I got a bone to pick with you. <laughs> for sure. I'm glad we was able to sit down and make this happen though. For Absolutely. sure, though. No, for sure. Yeah. So in the meantime, though, tell the people like how they can order it. I guess I know we can't order it from Michigan, um, but <laughs> just go to the Instagram. It's Thoughts Bourbon mm -hmm. um, on Instagram, and then then go back to the to the website and get the order online. But as far as for Michigan, it's going to be available soon. So for sure. Cool. All right, man. Well, Hardy, thanks for stopping through with us, Thank dog. You. Thanks for hanging My out pleasure. with the gang. Uh, that's it for this episode, dog. Make sure you check out Thoughts. And I guess you can go ahead and check out Concrete Thoughts, too. Like, you can check it out now because <laughs> he done told me how to fix it. <laughs> <laughs> On that note, man, we out of here, dog. Thanks for the whole gang dropping through, man. I got my man Angry Principal in the building. Drink what you like, how you like. Got my man Bo holding it down. And, of course, man, it's your boy Q Lewis holding it down live. Front of 48205, man. Red zone, baby. Peace out, y'all.